Hey everybody, it's Random, and today I have for you guys some more Call of Duty Ghosts, of course. And this is my very first KEM strike that I've got in Call of Duty Ghosts. And I can't believe I got this on launch day, uh, because it usually takes me, I'd say, two or three days to get into the swing of the game, and then go on to get my Moabs and my Nuclears. Uh, because on Modern Warfare 3, it did take me a week to get used to the game after playing Black Ops 1, because uh, them two games are completely different. And it was the same on Black Ops 2, it took me a couple of days, and then... Once I hit the first one, I started to hit more and more, and I got hundreds of Moabs and about 60 Nuclears, so it's all about getting your very first one. It doesn't matter how slow it is at all, you just have to get your very first KM strike, and then go on from there. And that's exactly what I do in this game. Uh, the start is a lot better than the end, I think I get specialists quite quickly, and then I play really, really defensive, and I'm kind of sitting near the enemy spawn, or where I think they're spawning. And I'm just waiting for them to come towards me. And I think this is around 5 minute 30 mark, which really isn't that great a time for this kind of streak. Uh, especially because Moabs tended to be like 3 minutes long. Uh, so I'm hoping to get a lot better ones than this, and I believe I should do. Uh, just for the fact, it's all about getting that very first one. And then for some reason, once you hit one, it just seems to go on from there and you hit more and more. And you just have more confidence to go on and play. Because the game after me getting this KEM strike... Uh, I nearly came very close to another one, and I just got so much more confidence, I could run around the map, and I played a lot smarter than I did uh, before I got the streak. Uh, so it's all about getting that very first one, and if you can do that, you'll be away. And the way I played this match, I played so... I, I used one perk so much, it was insane. And this is Amplify, so I put this, uh, put this perk on probably about two games before this. And I didn't realise how overpowered this would be, because you can hear footsteps really well in this game anyway. And when you have Amplify on, you can literally hear them coming towards you from absolutely miles away. It's ridiculous. So if you want to go for a chem strike in this game, definitely put Amplify on, because it will make a lot of difference. And I think once I've put it on, I've had some really, really decent gameplays, and it's one of the best perks I've had in this game. And the gun I was actually using in this match was the MSBS Assault Rifle, and this is probably the best gun, well, it's definitely the best gun that I've used in this game so far, by an absolute mile, and it's surprising because it's a burst gun, and me and burst guns don't really get on too well, uh, but it is a really awesome weapon, especially because the maps are so big, and there's a lot of medium to long range, and this gun can kill people in one burst, I think I got a triple collateral uh, with one burst with this gun, so definitely recommend trying it out because it's so overpowered and I will give you guys a class setup with this gun when I get around to it because I still haven't used all the perks and got uh, the right starting perks and the specialist perks or the assault streaks or anything like that I'm not sure what is, what is the best stuff to use yet so once I sort out all my perks and that I will give you guys the best class setup for this gun because uh, if you just put this gun on and just try it out and put a red dot on with extended mags you will be away and it's just such an awesome gun I literally can't put it down uh, the only other gun I've been using is the honey badger which is absolutely awesome uh, but I will get you guys some more class setups once I get around to it uh, but I'm still just trying to level up because I need some more squad points to buy these guns because it takes so long to rank up it's just ridiculous and the only thing I do struggle with in this game is the spawns so the spawns in this game make absolutely no sense to me at all uh, because if you think on domination if you have the A and B flag you would think they would spawn on the C flag and they just don't half of them will do and then the half of them will spawn on the A flag and then there'll just be random people just spotted around the map which is just absolutely ridiculous and it just makes no sense to me at all because if you've gone on like a death streak where you've died four times in quick succession you'll notice them four spawn points are literally spotted all around the map in completely random places and I was just thinking how can I spawn here and then spawn on the other side and then go back to the other side it just makes absolutely no sense to me the spawn system and that's why I've been struggling to get really high kill gameplays because I just don't know where the enemy team's gonna spawn and they could just be right behind me so that's why I'm really loving Amplify right now because if somebody spawns in my back even if they've got dead silence on I'm gonna know they're there because Amplify is just absolutely ridiculous and I definitely definitely recommend putting it on because it's an absolutely awesome perk and it will help you out with the spawn system in this game especially on the certain maps which are really close quarters like Strike Zone and 
it definitely is the perk to use and once I get a good class set up I will show you guys what to use as your perks uh, but I'm gonna leave it here guys I hope you enjoyed this streak and I'll hopefully get a couple more KM strikes today um, and get you guys more and more gameplays as the day goes on and I might upload a nice streak I got with a juggernaut if you guys want to see that because uh, I think I get about 10 or 11 kills with the juggernaut maniac streak running around stabbing which is pretty awesome and it's a bit of a laugh compared to going for nuclears all the time but anyway guys I'm gonna leave it here I hope you enjoyed this video and please leave a like rating and don't forget to sub it'd be much appreciated and I will see you guys later goodbye